Alright guys, welcome to another Python Chef video. In this video we're going to talk about SQL Server permissions errors and how to resolve those. So first thing you need to make sure you're logged into the login. Like if your computer has multiple logins, you need to make sure you're logged into the user where SQL Server was originally installed. And the reason for that is by default it becomes the system administrator and this took me forever to figure out. So I'm currently in the login where it was installed. So now I can go to the server and underneath security folder, there's a login uh, folder. You're going to right click that new login. And here at this next window is where you're going to create that login with system admin permissions so that you can go back to the login you usually use and be able to do whatever you need, whether that's create a database, import data, whatever. So you're going to choose the option for SQL Server Authentication, and you're going to create that user. You're going to add a password. You're going to go to Server Roles, and this is where you're going to click Sysadmin, and this will give you the ability to do what you need to in SQL. You'll hit OK. Boom. Now underneath Logins, we've got our user. Perfect. So now when you log out and go to the user on the computer you normally use SQL in, you're gonna when SQL opens and you're gonna connect to the server, you're gonna choose the SQL Server Authentication option. And here is where you're gonna type in your user information. And when you hit connect, it'll connect you right away and you'll be able to do whatever you need to in SQL. So thanks for joining. Hope you have a great day and don't forget to subscribe.